DJ Sherlock. And I'm Luke Sean. And this is the Nerd Show. Yeah, I'm really nerdy. Yeah, Nerd Wars. This is the show where we're going to talk about all that random stuff, like things like music, movies, dating, all that stuff you like to talk about, and video games. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> dating? Nerds are going to watch this. You know I've got to do it. Like... Yeah, they're, they're, yeah, all you nerds watching, um, maybe you could get some tips or something if you want to learn how to actually speak to a girl, because I know most of you can't do that. So, oh. maybe you'll get some tips or something. So, let's get on with our first topic. Uh, we're going to have debates, uh, we're going to have topics, things like movies, music, everything that's hot and new. So, let's start with our first debate. It's kind of a nerdy debate, and Luke's going to tell you what it's about. Um, we've decided that in uh, video games, there's an infection mode on Halo Reach that... Many of you guys think is the best, and um, I think it is. I, I don't play that often other game variants, but the only time I do play this game, I'm playing Infection. Yeah, so you see the debate is, I think that Infection's a great game, but you shouldn't always play that. You should have a variety of all the other game types. See, see he plays this game a, like a lot more than, I mean, I, I play it a lot, but I only play Infection, and he plays all sorts of variety. And I'm really bad at everything else, so... <laughs> yeah, exactly, but you're bad at it because you don't practice. You have to start somewhere. I, I guess so. I mean, I don't know. Um, I think that everybody that watches this video, you should leave um, your vote, whether me or PJ are right. Just comment on the video. PJ right that you should have a variety of game types, or Luke's right that just playing Infection is fine. Infection, yeah. <laughs> Infection's good, but... You're like a noob if that's the only thing you play. Oh, oh alright. Let's get on to our next topic. Luke is going to talk about the new hot music that you should be listening to. Alright, um, basically right now in this part of the year, um, you have Golden Globes and stuff in the music, in the, not in the music world, but in the uh, movie world, which is kind of like that. It's basically starting up. I mean, it's kind of cold around here, so things are really starting up, and 2012 is really getting going. And we've got a lot of music that's going to start coming out, and we already have some stuff that came out from couple months ago, but we got Nicki Minaj and Turn Me On, and that's a great song. It's a great um, song. Really, st it's, um, if you really haven't listened to a lot of music, that's a really good song to start you off on. Um, but uh, Good Feeling, would, um, that is a really good song. That's another song I got with Flo Rida, that if you know what music is, you will appreciate this song. It's, um... Hey, look, I have a question. If you're chilling with one of your ladies or something, and you just wanted to get it going and stuff, what song would you play? Uh, well, I mean, it depends. If you have, like, a normal chick, like, I mean, with me, I can do anything I want. So, I mean... Oh, of course you can, yeah. Like, I, I'd throw in Bow Chicka Wow Wow. Bow Chicka Wow Wow. That is a, it's a classic. I mean, if you want to get anything going, oh, that is your song you want to pick, man. I mean, All right, ladies, anything. comment on this. If you're hanging out with your guy... All of a sudden, he turns on Bow Chicka Wow Wow. Comment what you would do. <laughs> I know exactly. I oh. would go all the way. It would be the best thing ever. Bow Chicka Wow Wow, people. Thanks. It's the way to go. All right, let's get on to our next topic, which is mine. I'm going to talk about new movies and stuff that's out. Uh, so first of all, The Devil Inside came out a couple days ago or something. It's getting a lot of good reviews. Um... I've heard a lot about people having to leave the theater because there's some pretty disturbing stuff in that thing. It can be pretty, pretty freaking freaky. So basically, if you want that kind of date where you're not watching the movie and the girl is just going to be like on top of you screaming, then definitely take her to see this. I, that, yeah. That's the most kind of movie. No, listen, this kid, <laughs> he thinks everything's so scary. I don't understand. Like, it's not that scary. It's just a movie. Come on. Uh, okay, Luke's... Yeah, he thinks that it wouldn't be scary, so all of you who have seen this, why don't you try to tell Luke how scary it's been. It's, anyway, it's going to be great. It's another good movie scary. coming out. Um, <laughs> the Woman in Black. It's not out yet. It's like another horror film, but it's less scary, I guess you could say. It's not like, boom, rated R scariness. It's like a PG-13, but it's also pretty freaky. That'd be another good movie to take your girl to. That's probably one of my picks. Looks pretty good, too. And if you're in the mood to please a chick and give her a chick flick, Take her to that weird movie. I think it's called um, Joyful Noise or something. I had this chick ask me to go to that, and I was like, uh, okay. Huh. But if you want to make him happy, you just take him to that. You're probably going to fall asleep or something, but. What? what? Joyful Noise? I don't know. Some new chick flick up about some, like, play or something that they all, like, sing all these classic songs. I don't even know, but all the chicks are, like, freaking out over it. 
What the hell? I don't, I, I, it's not like I want to see it, but yeah, so. You want to see Joyful No, boys? I don't, but if you, <laughs> no, I don't, I didn't, I said I, it's not like I want to see it. Okay, but dear. if you wanted to make a chick happy, I'd take okay. her to this movie. Anyway, um, so basically, this is our show, and we're going to do later uh, different segments, like giving advice, so if you have a problem or something, or you need guy help, or something like that, just, uh. Leave a comment or email me at... Just to, wait, just to be clear, there's only one guy here. There are two guys. One men guy. Here. All right, there's one guy here and a man here. Oh, oh you're on the <laughs> Anyway, um, uh, yeah, so if you want some advice from me, email me at SherlockPJ at Yahoo.com. And if you want advice from Luke... Uh, email him at shotinluke at yahoo.com. Um, we'll also um, put in the description below, we'll have a link to um, Yahoo and um, or your email address. We'll have um, Gmail and Yahoo and we'll have our internet um, email addresses. Also, we'll have both the songs I talked about and both the movies um, on IMDb for him. And um, it will just be on YouTube for me. Yep. So I think we are about running out of time, so we will see you in our next segment. Remember, subscribe, like, do all that good stuff to keep us going. Thanks, YouTube. Bye.